voting for Biden. Uh, Sanders is a little too extreme for me. I think Biden's electable. Uh, he's a gentleman. That impresses me. I believe that um, Donald Trump, while certainly his tweeting and his demeanor could, could be improved. I wish he was not like that. Um, but I do believe that Donald Trump has made commitments um, during his campaign of things that he would pursue, policies that he would pursue, and he is stuck by that. He has not gone out there and um, by the whim of pollsters changed his philosophy. He is stuck with what he said from the very beginning. And I think that that, it, unfortunately for a lot of Democratic voters or the, or the Bernie Sanders supporters, that's the reason why he's so popular, because he has held these beliefs his entire political career and he doesn't stray from it at all. And he sticks with it. And so it's believable. And that's what people want in their, in the, in their political leaders is belief. They want to believe that their philosophy is not going to change. They want to believe that they're going to stick to their guns and pursue the policies that they've stated that they will pursue. president who's a leader. We need a president who's honest and uh, kind. You know, you can think what you want, but there are just certain things you shouldn't say out loud, and particularly not if you have a big microphone like he does. So I, I, he offends me. <laughs> Sorry, he just does. If there had been a Democrat that I liked, I would have voted for him, but they're too unpredictable right now, I think. The Democratic Party has just totally gone off the rails, and they, they're so fractured to begin with, and now they're just, all they can do is spew hatred, and I am just not into that, so.